Moses and the Bulrushes. This is baby Moses. He is just three months old. He was born in Egypt a very long time ago. Moses' parents were Hebrews. The Egyptians made the Hebrews work very hard, building cities and temples. This is the king of Egypt. He was a cruel man. He was afraid the Hebrews would not obey the people of Egypt. The baby boys must die. The king ordered his soldiers to find all the Hebrew baby boys and kill them. Moses' mother decided to hide her son. Please don't cry, she said. She was afraid the Egyptian soldiers would find him and kill him. She took her baby to the river. Moses' mother went to the Nile. She cut down lots of bulrushes and made them into a big basket. She put Moses in the basket. She kissed him and put the basket down on the water. The basket floated away. Moses' sister was on the river bank. She watched the basket. She followed it as it floated down the river. Moses was asleep in the basket. It floated past the prince of Egypt. She was bathing in the water with her maids. The princess saw the baskets. What's that? she said. Bring it here. One of the maids picked up the basket. The princess looked at Moses. Moses woke up and cried. What a lovely baby, said the princess. He must be a Hebrew boy. Moses' sister ran to the princess. Do you want a Hebrew nurse for the baby, she said. Yes, bring one to me, said the princess. Moses' sister went to get her mother. Look after this baby, said the princess. I will pay you well. Moses' mother took him home. Moses was safe. He grew up with his own family. When he was old enough, his mother took him back to the princess. This he is my son now, said the princess. Moses lived in the palace like an Egyptian prince, but he never forgot he was a Hebrew.